Dear viewers, I hope you are all fine. This ultrasound video shows a case of empty gestation sac in the uterus without any fetal pole in it. You can see the uterus having an empty gestational sac, an absent fetal pole can mean several things including blighted ovum. A blighted ovum that is also called an embryonic pregnancy is when fertilized egg implants in the uterus but doesn't grow into an embryo. This causes an early miscarriage. Too early if a pregnancy is not far enough along, you may not be able to see the embryo yet. So this pregnancy measures about 11 weeks. So the embryonic pole, fetal pole must be visible, but as in this case, the gestation sac is empty. So this is a case of blighted ovum. It is usually identified at six weeks when vaginal ultrasound with vaginal ultrasound and at six and a half weeks with abdominal ultrasound. However, it is not unheard for the fetal pole to not uh, to invisible until about nine weeks. The general recommendations are to wait for two weeks if we only see a gestation sac and at least 11 days at if a gestational or yolk sacs are seen without a fetal pole. So most of the sonographers prefer to wait for two weeks for the next ultrasound in both of these scenarios. Now the em empty gestation sac will not turn into an embryo. The formation of embryo occurs within two weeks of conception. By the time the gestational sac is formed, the cells should have already formed an embryo. So as in this case, there is no fetal pole. The fetal pole is usually identified at 6.5 weeks with transabdominal ultrasound imaging and at six weeks, two days with an with the transvaginal ultrasound imaging. Although it may not be visible until nine weeks in some cases, when the fetal bowl measures seven millimeter or more, a fetal heartbeat should be detected. You can find some important information in the description of this video. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe my channel. If you do like this video, please click the like button. Thanks.